Your child's doctor has recommended surgery to remove a cataract from your child's eye. A cataract is clouding of the normally clear lens inside the eye. Vision will be dim or blurry, and things will not appear as bright or colorful as they are. In an infant or a young child, a cataract can keep their vision from developing normally. That could lead to permanent vision loss later in life. Cataract surgery is when an eye surgeon removes the cloudy, natural lens from the eye. Sometimes the surgeon will replace the cloudy lens with an artificial lens implant. Normally, the eye's lens is clear, allowing light rays to pass through and focus precisely on the retina. As a cataract forms, the lens gradually becomes cloudy. As light passes through this cloudy lens, it no longer focuses clearly on the retina and images appear hazy or blurred. Cataract surgery for children is usually done as an outpatient procedure. Your child will be given a general anesthesia so that he or she is deeply asleep during surgery. Babies may have the procedure done in a hospital where they will stay for up to a day after surgery. This is to monitor them after having anesthesia. During cataract surgery, your child's ophthalmologist will make a small opening in the side of the cornea or in the white of the eye. He or she will insert an instrument that suctions out the cloudy lens. Small stitches are used to close the incision in the side of the cornea. These stitches will dissolve on their own. Your pediatric ophthalmologist will discuss what kind of lens will be used to provide focus after the cloudy lens is removed. In some cases, the surgeon will insert an artificial replacement lens called an intraocular lens, or IOL. The new, clear lens allows light to pass through and focus properly on the retina. It is very likely your child will need glasses after surgery for the best vision. Instead of having an IOL implanted, many babies and young children will wear contact lenses to focus after surgery. This is often recommended as the best option for very young growing eyes. Your child's ophthalmologist will teach you how to insert these contact lenses. They are specially designed to be easier than adult contacts to handle and put in the eye. If a child has a cataract removed from only one eye, they may need to wear a patch on the other eye. This forces the child to use the weaker eye that had the cataract, which helps develop better vision. They will wear the patch for a certain number of hours each day, as recommended by the pediatric ophthalmologist. As with any surgery, there are possible risks with cataract surgery. Cataract surgery risks can include infection in the eye, bleeding in the eye, swelling of the cornea, swelling of the retina, retinal detachment, where the retina lifts up from the eye wall. People who are very nearsighted are more at risk for this. Pieces of the cloudy lens left inside the eye increased pressure in the eye, drooping eyelid, problems with the iris, seeing double, losing some or all vision, and needing to have more surgery. The only way to remove a cataract is with surgery. Your child does not have to have cataract surgery. However, if the cataract is not removed, your child may suffer permanent vision loss. That means even if the cataract is removed from the child's eye later in life, that eye will not see. If you have any questions or concerns about the procedure, ask your pediatric ophthalmologist. He or she will be happy to help you understand the risks and benefits of cataract surgery for your child. Also, if you have any questions or concerns about your child's eyes or vision in general, don't hesitate to bring them up. Your ophthalmologist is committed to protecting your child's sight.